Hola, it's Gabby here for Casti Gabby and today I'm going to make a car with coffee cups. I'm going to use the stamp from Joy Claire. It's called uh, My Cup Product Over. Uh, half a stack of cups that I'm going to stamp with my memento inks in um, Nina Solar White 80 pounds because, because I'm going to color with my copy markers I'm going to use like a kind of a rainbow um, theme in my cups but it's not exactly like rainbow but it's kind of uh, full of color I um, when I'm finished coloring this, I'm going to cut it with my scissors because I don't know if these stamps have the die cuts. If they have, I don't have it. After I finish cutting, I'm going to use my memento ink and go my memento marker, sorry, and go all around the image. After that, I'm going to uh, grab craft paper. No, sorry. In here, I'm adding glossy accent to the dripping coffee in the cups. Um, while I'm waiting for that to dry, I'm going to grab craft paper and I'm going to stamp it with coffee beans. I'm also going to grab one and color it with a vintage photo with distress, distress oxidize and grab a embossing folder and emboss um, wood grain and down I'm coloring with my distress inks in uh, ground espresso yeah in ground espresso and I'm going to glue it down in the bottom of the my card panel then I'm going to glue my cups and the part of the coffee that is uh, dripping in the table. I'm going to cover with these die cuts, the letter coffee. The le this letter are like an uh, inch and a half, something like that. They are a little bit big, but I like big stem and big, big, die cut, big die cuts, yeah. And I'm going to color the letters in the same gamma uh, of um, the same color that the coffee have. If uh, you see there, the F have sharing the green and the yellow and the pink. Um, the pink also share with the purple and stuff like that. When I finish coloring this, I'm going to cut the same letters in black for the letters to have a border the way they look more um, dimensional and notable when I finish doing this I'm going to glue the letters down and I'm going to add the string glitter mud podge to the letters I love to do this because the letters look I love to do them in, in, in letters I do it a, a lot because the letters look so um, shiny and sparkly. Okay, now I'm going to glue my car panel to um, black um, paper that we have um, frame, and I'm going to glue this same colors in paper, the same color that I use for the coloring the cups. I'm going to grab paper in those colors. I'm going to cut a quarter of an inch, uh, a smaller and a smaller and a smaller each one. I'm going to glue from the corner, from the bottom left corner, and the way it, it do like a rainbow to the top. I'm going to glue everything to that corner and I'm going to make uh, the card base this card is 7 by 4 
and I cut the other one seven and a half and I fold the half and I glue them together and now I'm going to um, I cut the, the car a little bit bigger than the 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 car but the final car is seven uh, by four I left that to to stamp the sentiment because I was thinking that I'm going to choose a big sentiment but I found this um, from a set I think from MFT and I know I have to cut this part of the stamp to use it um, I like the well go with the coffee bean and adding right now um, gel pen in white I add in details in the cups and in the coffee that is dripping from the cup I'm using the glossy accents to um, protect the glitter from the mud podge in the letters and after it dries I'm going to add some jewels that the same color of the coffee these jewels are brown and I add in Winko Stella to the frame of the car and also to the polka dots in the cup when I'm finished doing this I'm going to do the oh well now that the glossy acting is dry in the letters I'm going to add also details in why with the white gel pen but now I'm going to make the inside of the car I make a, a, a separate panel and I add um, the stamp and also add coffee beans and I'm going to add um, stripes of the same color of the frame and the cups in the inside of the car after I finish that I'm going to glue this panel inside of the car and that will be my car for today well thank you for watching my videos until next car goodbye